Welcome to macOS anti-forensics and uh, the lab part. Um, in this uh, lab exercise we will look at CyberChef which is a tool which you can use for uh, different uh, counter forensics uh, techniques and uh, not especially against uh, software but more about uh, how to tamper with the data. As you can see, we have different operations here, about 200, as you already saw in one of the presentations. So it's from data format to networking, um, hashing, compression, daytime, whatever. Um, these operations can all be set, if you want, in a logical way, in a recipe, which we will see on later. And uh, with that recipe, we can um, process some files you put here as input and uh, then we will um, yeah, because it's cyberchef we will bake it like I said here and uh, the output will be then shown here uh, with the bake you can uh, yeah like I said you can do a lot of uh, operations in one recipe by clicking bake you can uh, then uh, perform these operations and by auto bake you will perform all of the operations in one and the, 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 these will then, these will then uh, temper uh, the input and uh, give uh, output as you like let's see how uh, well, you know, a bit of our operations uh, which will be also explain more in detail in other uh, lab experiments but you can have a date format uh, operation like here as you can see if we, if we hover on one of those uh, operations we can see that there is a, uh, a pop-up with some uh, text inside uh, information about that operation here it's uh, about uh, creating a hex dump of the input data and also a link to Wikipedia about the hex dump that's for all operations like two hex but also char code Octal, uh, which, all, which you also saw with um, steganography, base 64. So that's for data format. Um, but you can also do encryption, like AES encryption, Blowfish encryption, even XOR or, or Visionaire encoding. But even you can do uh, Morse code encryption. Or decryption so that's all uh, very uh, yeah like I said cyberchef is a very uh, broad tool to use for uh, different uh, data alterations let's go back to the equation cells uh, you can also change date times which you also see in, in later on in other experiments um, you can do hashing, compre compression, you can execute, different, uh, like gunzip and uh, gzip. Um, you can do, that's one, one I like, that's uh, other. That's about removing or uh, ex extracting or removing exif from your uh, image files. Uh, like I said, steganography is one of my hobbies, and um, this is uh, very handy when you are an forensics engineer and you want to have your uh, location data and etc. Um, removed from your uh, image file. Uh, they can, if uh, a forensic engineer uh, finds that photo, he can't uh, use uh, the exit data anymore for your uh, uh, for um, evidence against you because yeah it's already gone yeah that's uh, it uh, for a quick overview uh, like I said it's operations you have a recipe where you can put in the operations in a specific flow uh, you can put the input file you can put in the input menu and you can do for the output there's also uh, 
module which shows you the output. And we have uh, talked about how to bake the recipe, as I said here. That's it for now, let's go and see how we can do some different operations in CyberChef.